welcome to Exurban Dog Life. I wanted to make this video to try and connect with the audience, which is you spending your time on this platform watching some of my stuff. I'm a very tiny, tiny fish in a big pond, um, just throwing out basically shorts and having a blast doing it. It's a lot of fun, but uh, I want to tell you that I appreciate you. So uh, I wanted to reach out today in this video and just look at some fun um, dog quotes, famous dog quotes that I found online. There's a few here. Um, oh, you know what? I do want to address my chair because I had someone make a comment on my chair. Um, this old chair, I'm taping it together and like literally, you know, plastering it together. And guess what? It's not going on a curb anytime soon because it is super comfortable. Still looks really good. Forgive my mess, but it still looks decent. Um, and it's super comfortable. It works great other than a few tears and snares here and there. Hey, you know, material things age just like we do. Um, and then this is a scarf that my mom made. I feel like a magician. She made it for me while she was dying, but no one knew she was dying. And, uh, she passed like six months after she made this so it's sentimental to me and I just kind of keep it on the back of my busted chair okay all right so let's get started quotes uh Josh Billings I don't know who who Josh Billings is wrote a dog is the only thing on earth that loves you more than he loves himself I love that one uh, let's move on to this one. Kristen Higgins wrote, when an 85 pound mammal licks your tears away, then tries to sit on your lap, it's hard to be sad. That is so true. Um, if you're like me, you feel like you take, 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 take from your animals and only hope that they get a smidgen back from you of what they give you. I hope that makes sense. Um, but yeah, I like that quote too. Mary Oliver, I don't know who that is, wrote, because of the dog's joy joyfulness, our own is increased. It is no small gift. Bravo, this is perfect. That's exactly right. Um, it is a big deal that dogs give us so much, you know? Pardon me. Uh, my little dog, a heartbeat at my feet, Edith Wharton. I'm not sure who that was either, wrote that. <gasps> this is one of my favorites. It's by Bill Murray. He's the actor slash comedian. I'm sure he produces stuff too. So I got, you know what? You come visit me. I constantly have dog hairs, as you know, all over the place. So forgive me as I take one off my lip just there. Anyway, the one from Bill Murray, I'm suspicious of people who don't like dogs, but I trust a dog when it doesn't like a person. Mmm, Bill, that one is very deep. And so true, right? Dogs are the best judge of character. Moving right along. Emily Dickinson, she was a poet. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh my goodness. So see, you see why I don't do these very often because, yeah. Uh, dogs are better than human beings because they know but do not tell. I'm going to leave that one right there. Um, M.K. Clinton wrote, the world would be a nicer place if everyone had the ability to love as unconditionally as a dog. M.K. Clinton had the right stuff. Marilyn Monroe, late actress, stated, dogs never bite me, just humans. Ooh, Marilyn, that one was loaded. 
I'm going to leave that one right there too. Um, Roger Carez wrote, dogs are not our whole life, but they make our lives whole. So profound. Bravo. That's a good one. Oh, Carrie Underwood. We love our Carrie. Wrote, I've been accused in different dating situations of loving my dog more than I love the person I'm with. Ain't that the truth, sister? Um, okay, let's do a couple more. My dog is half pit bull, half poodle. Not much of a watchdog, but a vicious gossip. <laughs> I like that's cute. Comedian Craig Shoemaker um, wrote that quote. Barack Obama, former U.S. president, wrote, a lot of shelter dogs are mutts like me. Not touching that one either. Will Rogers, humorist, wrote, If there are no dogs in heaven, then when I die, I want to go where they went. So true. So true if we can all only be so lucky. Um, author of Marley and Me, isn't that a film from the 90s or the early 2000s? John Grogan wrote, It is amazing how much love and laughter they bring into our lives and even how much closer we become with each other because of them. It's a good one. That's a good one. Charles M. Scholes. You all know him as the creator and illustrator of the Peanuts series. Um, all his life, he tried to be a good person. Many times, however, he failed. For after all, he was only human. He wasn't a dog. <laughs> oh my gosh, these are great. Well, there's a ton more of these dog quotes and they're just online and um, I thought, oh my gosh, how appropriate that would be to just kind of, you know, chat and gab a little bit with you all over some of these. Um, let's go ahead and do one more. Oh, the late, great George Carlin, who was a comedian for you younger ones who may not know. I don't, I don't know. Um, most of us know George Carlin. He, uh, his famous quote with dogs, life is a series of dogs. You know, so true. Um, Cause I think once you're a dog lover and once you have a dog, you'll always be a dog lover and you'll always have dogs. So that that is a very appropriate quote. All right, well, in winding down, I just want to thank you for spending time with me. 